Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I am clearing my freezer out. Not fully, it's not full on freezer clearance. Don't get bored, don't turn off. I'm trying to clear it out because you know when it's just jam packed, I don't know about you guys, but I, it just does my head in. It's like having loads of stuff in like the food cupboard behind me when it's just loads of things. I'm just like, I just don't feel, just don't feel okay. So I need to clear my freezer out. Uh, so that's what we're gonna be doing today. Eating freezer food that I just need to pull out and you know, clear it. So it's not really a very good description of the video. Almost like a what I eat in a day. I don't know, let's get straight into the video. Hope you guys enjoy this one. If you do, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to my channel. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy this one. Good evening. Right, we're skipping back in time. I don't know what I said because it's the night before currently and I obviously haven't filmed stuff. So it's quarter past 11. I just realized that I've got to get stuff out of my freezer. Let me just show you how full my freezer is. It makes me sick. Like, you know when it's just like jam. Okay, that was a good example, look at this. Okay, but that's not good. Okay, they all seem to be open, but um, you know it's just jam packed. It just absolutely does my head in. So I'm gonna get my breakfast out. Now I've seen in one of them, somewhere like there they are, look, under there, some pancakes. They have been in there a while. How long can you go with like having things in the freezer? We'll just try this tomorrow, yeah? August, 27th of August. You know what, I, I don't even know which August that was. Probably, hopefully, the one just gone. Uh, so yeah, I will see you in the morning. A lovely little breakfast. Morning, guys. Breakfast. I'm having, obviously, as you saw, pancakes. With a little bit of chocolate on top. Yummy. I'm only having two, there were four in the pack, but I don't think I can have four pancakes. Or well, to be fair, I probably could eat four pancakes, but I don't want to eat four pancakes because I feel like death straight after, I would have thought. These have actually been in my freezer a very long time because this is a bit embarrassing. I bought them for my last 10,000 calorie challenge and that was a year ago maybe just more than a year ago how long do you guys have things in your freezers for <laughs> and is, is there like a time scale where you should just chuck stuff out I think I need to do that and have a bit more chocolate there are a lot of things in my freezer and there are some things that I am going to chuck out because there's some, like, say, like I've bought a pack of two, I don't know, there's like chicken Kiev and another chicken thing in there. And we've had one of each. I don't know when it would have happened, why we've only had one of each. Because we there's two of us, I don't know why we didn't just eat two. But they've gone in my freezer and like, where they're not like in packaging still, because there's only one, like the packing has been opened. That makes me feel weird. Like they've been frozen in the, I don't know. I don't even know how to explain it, but at least if you put something in their hole, like the packaging's protecting it. Do you know what I mean? Or am I just weird? But as they're in there at the moment, there's no protection. And it makes me feel weird. So I think I have to just chuck those out because I don't want to eat them. I don't know why, can't explain it, but yeah, they're not for me. I don't know if this video is a bit boring. It's basically what I eat a day really, isn't it? But using up the things in my freezer because every week I have to buy something that like does go in the freezer, I don't have to, but like, I don't know, certain garlic bread might go in the freezer or a pizza or something goes in the freezer. I will use it, but, or chips, but when I went shopping on Saturday or Sunday, whenever I went, when I brought it back, I had to like stuff it, stuff a lot of things in the freezer, like shove it in and it was stressing me out because I thought anything else can't go in there. So that's why I decided to do today's video. And I've just realised I was supposed to do an intro before this. Now I'm gonna have to do it when I'm dressed. I don't know why, I always used to do like the intro when I'm dressed and it would hop back to breakfast or something, but 
I prefer starting it like there and then now. Now I've forgotten to do it. I don't know why. You guys probably don't even care, but I prefer like it not looking so like jumpy. I don't even know how to explain it. It's not even jumpy because I watch I watch other people's videos where they do that, like do an intro and then it jumps back to breakfast. It doesn't bother me, but I don't know. I prefer it. Anyway, I'm li literally talking crap. This morning I've been really busy sorting stuff and my hair's just scrambled already and it's literally, it's 10 o'clock and my hair is like, what the hell? I need to do my lashes. I don't know if you can tell, this eye, my right eye. <laughs> I don't know what I was like, this one. There's like lashes missing. I need to redo them before I come back for lunch. So they look terrible. I'm going to finish this off and I will see you for some lunch. Right, it's time for some lunch. And you're seeing I'm not jumping back in time. So lunch is just going to be a thing that's meant to be frozen anyway. Hmm, where is it? There he is. I think I've eaten one of these with you before. I have this. Cheese and bean bake. I'm pretty sure there's only one left. Yeah. There's one left in there. And usually if I wasn't going to have what I'm having for dinner, you have, I was going to say what it is, because I filmed obviously bits last night, but you haven't seen that yet. Um, it's quite a big dinner, so I don't want to have too much for lunch. So I am just going to have that. So, yeah, I'm going to pop that in the oven now. 25 minutes. Why does it always have to take so long? Um, anyway, yeah. I always get worried with my freezer, like I don't shut the door properly. It just panics me. I'm going to pop that in the oven and it is nice. I've had it before, but I will sit down with you guys in 20 minutes. Right. I've just had to brave the outdoors. I don't know where you guys live in the UK, but at the moment, the weather... It's not good. No other thing to say about it. It's meant to be a storm. I want to say Storm Kira and I could be completely wrong. But it's horrible out there. So I just had to brave going out. Did I tell you that a minute ago? I know I said I had to get something. I can't remember, but I had to brave going out and it's rubbish. So now I'm back in my warm, cozy house with a nice, warm, cozy lunch. It's not exactly the most appealing. I've just had to cut it open because I know it's going to be boiling hot. But... I would much rather go off to Greg's and get a little cheese and bean melt. But, you know, then my fridge wouldn't be clearing out, would it? Hopefully I've left it to cooler long enough. Still a bit hot, but I reckon this might be the best one that I've made. Because I put it in the oven and then nipped out, so I put it on a lower temperature. But the, on the box it says to put it in the oven for 25 minutes on 200. And it basically just burns it. <laughs> it's really annoying. So I put it in. I did one. I put it at 160. Just because my, the shop that I went to. Tesco is literally around the corner. It would not have been 20 minutes. But you know. In my mind I was panicking. So I put it on 160. And it was in there for 20 minutes. And I think it's come out. The best I've ever had. Yeah. Very good. Um. Do you like my hair, by the way? I've just kind of come on here with completely different hair and just haven't, you know, said anything. I, uh, a little while back, do you remember before my holiday, I went and got like a money piece and my hair darker. And I really liked it. And obviously my mum is the ha my hairdresser. She, she's a hairdresser, so my mum's done it. So she, cause I don't really bother with getting my hair like done. She didn't do a permanent color. So it obviously faded. Um, I feel like this probably will anyway, but I really liked it, so I went back and had it, and I asked her for some more blonde, so got some more blonde at the front and then dark, but the reason it's straight is because the products that they have at the salon, when I have my hair curly natural, I literally use a Tesco one pound mousse, and any others, the mo more expensive mousses that I use in my hair, it, it's just horrible, it makes my hair horrible, like it makes it all crispy, and she wanted to try out different things on my hair, so we straightened it, and that's why it's straight. Um, we tried out the GHD, their straighteners and hair dryer at the same time. It literally dries dries your hair as you straighten it. I I don't think it's very good. We got halfway through, and it was making my hair like 
a little bit frizzy as it was doing it which it's not what we want so we dried it off and then just did it normally we were talking about hair straighteners because my mum was like she was saying about like ghd hair straighteners and she was like all the different ones they've brought out my favorite ones are always like the original ones i don't know what they're called but the original ones and we start i started saying i said do you remember oh, i just ate my hair do you remember straighteners like years ago before they like years and years ago before they were actually good like you get the big bulky one i don't like you guys i might be showing my age here my first pair of straighteners hair straighteners i don't know what they're called they were white with like a blue what are they called the bit that actually straightens your hair plate i think it's a plate you had to put water there was a little plastic thing that you would take off put water in it clip back in let that heat up almost like an iron she couldn't remember it but i can do any of you guys remember that or was that is that just me going mental am i just i don't know i'm pretty sure that was the thing surely it was before i blab too much i'm gonna finish this and then see you for dinner i don't have any snacks because i don't really keep snacks in my freezer so yeah we're going straight in for dinner so i'll see you then hi guys right we're back in the same place i've literally just filmed me telling you what i'm having for breakfast and now i'm gonna dig out some stuff that i'm gonna have for dinner obviously um i think i'm gonna make if i can find it there it is it's under here i'm gonna have oh my god this is just awful please don't judge me <laughs> hang on i need two hands mince meat i've uh i don't know how long this has been there so hopefully it doesn't kill me but i'm gonna make myself a lasagna not myself me and josh we're gonna have lasagna so yeah but it's not really making a dent in my freezer at all literally two things i've taken out so we might do this video again let me know if you enjoy it but anyway you're still gonna speak to me in a sec so let's jump back into the future for me but the present i don't know let's actually make some food as you would have saw I'm making lasagna. I feel like ugh, I'm getting confused because obviously last night I said a load of stuff to you and now I can't remember what I said, but did I tell you that we're making lasagna? Pretty sure we did. Probably just doing two bits in the same thing, but I need to crack on. I would usually kind of cook with you, but it's it's half four and dinner should be ready by half five and I feel like it's not going to because it's a lasagna, but I'm gonna try my hardest. So I've got to go. Fingers crossed it's a nice lasagna. Right, the lasagna's in the oven, and the last thing for dinner that I'm gonna get out of the freezer, some garlic bread. Um, this is actually freezer garlic bread. I actually picked the wrong one up. Usually I like to pick up the fridge one so it doesn't clog my freezer. This is what I was meaning earlier when I said about food just being on its own. Like, look, that is now, I can't eat that. There's the package for it. I can't eat that, I'm gonna have to chuck it in bin. <laughs> chuck it in bin. Uh, so, uh, yeah, garlic bread to go with that lasagna. That is all we're gonna have. I feel like lasagna is really filling. Sometimes you can have chips with it, but or salad. We've got no salad, so that's all we're gonna have. So yeah, I will show you it once it's ready. But I'm not gonna eat it with you because it's a lasagna. So, and you've probably heard enough of my crap. But obviously, I'll be having pudding. So catch you then. Here's the lasagna. Don't honestly know what I'm showing you because you all know what lasagna looks like. But I've got this, and then garlic bread obviously it doesn't really look like much but i feel like lasagna is just really filling but yeah i'm having this look at the cheese Yum. it's a lot later it's now eight o'clock i'm obviously back in the pjs the sloth pjs and it's time for some dinner no it's not it's time for some pudding so pudding obviously we just kind of wanted to use up things that are in the freezer so i'm gonna have these for pudding really annoying actually though because i'm not gonna eat them all and that is really annoying. So these are mini bites, uh, cookies and cream, which is basically Oreo flavor. They're really nice, but there's three of them in there. And I don't want three. I feel like literally one is enough. So that is quite annoying. But they're like those little, um, you know, those mochi balls you get. You've got to leave them out for like five minutes and then they're nice. So I'm gonna have that, but I'm not obviously gonna wait for five minutes with you guys. So hope you don't mind. But I have actually had these before in one of my videos with you. So if you're that bothered, 
you can search through i can't remember which video it was but um yeah i'm gonna go and do that and chill on the sofa i've got a bit of bake off that i need to catch up on so and i've got to get an early night so i've got to go into the office again tomorrow so annoying anyway my, me and my little mini bite i'm gonna chill on the sofa for the evening so i hope you guys have enjoyed this one it's a bit of a weird one i don't even know what i'm gonna name it obviously named it by now but you know who knows anyway I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway if you did please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to my channel but that's all for now can you tell that i just play with my hair because it's straight i just play more maybe a bit of time anyway thank you guys for watching i will see you in my next video